Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. Today I've got the FireQuest Pitbull round. It's a specialty 12 gauge round. Oh, uh, let's see. Here's the package. Center. There we go. Let me read you the back. Uh, pure power. The Pitbull is a powerful 12 gauge round packed with six double op buck pellets topped with a heavy duty 1.3 ounce slug loaded extra hot for maximum stopping power. Once it bites, it won't let go. This is the number one rated ammo for home and self-defense. Two and three quarter round for use in 12 gauge shotgun only. All right, so let's give these a test and see how they work. Well, first up, I thought we'd see what it, how it patterns. Um, I've got one of my splatter targets set up back there. Um, I am shooting at seven yards. All these are going to be at seven yards because that's supposed to be the, the optimal self-defense distance. So, and I'm shooting them out of my uh, Panzer Arms BP-12 bullpup. So, let's see how these things work. They're supposed to be extra hot, so I'm looking forward to that. Yeah, it was a little hot. Not terrible, though. Uh, I can only see a couple on there. Let's get a closer look. Okay, so not terrible. Um, I should have put a fresh target up behind this, the cardboard, but I didn't because I thought I had, but I didn't apparently. So here's the slug. Here is one of the holes. Two, three, four, five. So I guess the rest just missed it around. Uh, that looks like one, but there's no hole in the wood, so it's not it. So let's move on and see what a mirror shot looks like. So now for what I'm sure you guys are all waiting for, the mirror shot. I'm going to shoot at a mirror, have my camera pointed at the mirror so we can see what it looks like from the target's perspective. Let's give it a shot. I will bet you that some of these pellets hit the steel protecting my camera. Well, looks like I hit it a little high and to the right. <laughs> I enjoy those. Well, there's only one thing left to do, and that's to shoot a watermelon with this. Uh, I know it's kind of cliche for videos, but boy, it sure does look good. So, here we go. Well, shit. So every one of the pit bull rounds ended up shooting high with these sights, but I just tested it with some bird shot and it was right on. Let's test it with a slug. Uh, these sights appear to be sighted in, but for some reason the pit bull was high. I'm going to aim at the steel target with the, I'm going to aim right at the red or the orange. Red, orange. So, just a hair low with a regular slug, but for some reason the pit bulls were all high, as you saw in a slow-mo. So, eh, there we go. I'm going to blow this watermelon up just because I want to see it. Ah, watermelon destruction never gets old. So, about well, you watermelon guts hit me. Um, the FireQuest pit bull rounds. I mean, they seem okay. Uh, they have a nice kick to them, so there's obviously some power behind it. Um, for whatever reason, they ended up shooting really high out of my shotgun. Um, and it's dead on with a regular slug or bird shot or anything else I've tried through it. So I don't know what the problem was with that. Um, I, these kind of rounds are neat, but I just don't see it being any more effective than either buckshot or a slug by itself. You know, personally, I'd go with buckshot for self-defense, but hey, they should be effective if you can hit anything. Um, 
that's it for this video. Uh, if you like this video and want to see more like it, subscribe to my channel. If you thought I did something wrong or have a suggestion for future video, put them in the comments below. Take care, everybody.